All right, good morning. Out here for uh, another weekend, doing some more archery deer hunt. Mike, Jacob, and we have Russell with us this morning. Main focus. Yep, Russell's a shooter. Russell's a shooter, so. Go out and play. Kick it off with a nice little hike back into some woods. See if we can find a good buck. Yep. How you feeling, Russell? Doing good, feeling good. Hey, rock? Rock and roll. All right. See what we can get into. See you in a little bit. Get up here and keep looking and see if we can sound, find a spot to plop down for a little bit. Let's Take go. a break for a few minutes. Let's wrap around. I think behind us is too thick. Right, over there. Too thick. Right here. Which is basically it's that big, big, big valley. Yeah, right, right in front of this ridge right here. You can just see what was down in there. In this valley right here. Yeah. Yeah. We'll go up on here and then we'll glass all this down here. And yeah. Look at all this. And if we need to, we find a way in there though. Yeah. I'm kind of thinking we see what's, let's see what that this valley is. That's road. a pretty good sized valley. There's this road right here. My home. What you doing over here, buddy? Huh? What you doing over here? Get set up. Do some glassing. Right, getting comfy. Getting cozy. Awesome. Paint my little landscape. Got that last little bit of shade. Saw that. Oh, got your backrest. Oh. Man, you are gonna take a nap, aren't you? Now it's not with me on watch. Oh. See you know, so guys getting heavy. I'll do one of these. Wake up. Yeah. All right, we made it up here to a uh, our glassing spot for the top of this this little hill. We got views pretty much in probably at least 270 degrees. Found a small herd of does on our way up here. Wasn't any bucks, so it's unfortunate. But like I said, we got a great spot up here to glass. Mike's getting all sip over here. His uh, midday bedding spot is all bedded down. Yep. <laughs> He's getting all comfy cozy, so about a day and a half, two days to get one more buck in the bag. Our buddy Russell. It's a little bit warmer than it was last time. Yeah. A little bit warmer, so I don't know. We'll see how that plays out. I got nothing. Let's just find a deer. 
while you find the deer, I'm going to take a nap. I'm not looking for deer. <laughs> nah, your job's around that camera. Yeah, it is. Main issue is I cannot interfere with the hunt as I'm trying to document. <laughs> I've already gotten yelled at once, so we're going to have to make some stipulations in our contracts. I can see that right now. <laughs> no guarantees. <laughs> get what you get. Just be better. Yeah, just be better, he says. <laughs> All of it secret information. Oh, yeah, What's the plan? Go hunting. Trying to stay uh, localized. In, uh, no, there's another in Mexico, bro. Come on now. Do you know there's a Tucson, Mexico? Hunting for giant muleys in back countries. Some new toys. A little fat pile of golf balls. Well done, Mike. Welcome. See, you found welcome. something this morning. That's right. We found a buck. We found the next week's next week's golf balls. Oh, that's just nasty. This is a homeless person, probably. Just yeah. nasty. <laughs> Leaving the trash out here. We cleaned up some. Because then you're sitting here, you've got a good vantage point all in all four directions. Yep. So if they come up the ridge here, you yep. got them here, yep. you got them on this ridge, and you got them behind you. Yep. What are you waiting for? We have arrived at the afternoon rotation of our weekend. Um, it's kind of slow this morning. Not much happened, unfortunately. Uh, I've made one attempt on a couple spikes, but they ran away pretty quick. Coming back to this uh, high ground we were at this morning, see if we can get some more glass out there. Maybe spot a, a bear buck. I'll probably set up camp up here tonight and just see what comes through. Uh, see if we can get Russell's buck. Uh, 
Kita tak makan dia. Masyarakat. Ya. See that. I'm hoping if I can get up to this big tree, uh-huh. that if they're coming this way, I can take a shot, or I can turn and right get this side. Because one of them went down already. She's down in the bottom, and that one is just still stuck right there. Mm-hmm. I want to plop over here so mm-hmm. I can still see all of this. Right. So I'll plop over there. Okay. Got two layers of cold air there, on, so yeah, that's nice. Are you warm, cold? Uh, no, perfect. perfect. We're gonna uh, come back in this country. We jumped over this little knoll right here, and we got two does confirmed so far, right down here. Um, well, about 100 yards, 100 yards or so. So, what we're gonna do is come over this little knoll instead of being skylined so that deer don't see us in the uh, sunlight. We're gonna do one at a time, kind of creep around. Russ is going to come around and try to get in a position. These deer are kind of working this way a little bit, so we have not seen a buck in it, but we just want to get in good position for tonight. And then um, I think we're just either Jake, I think you're going to go with the shooter, and I'll probably just come right over here, pop down because I don't want to steal this country still. I mean, we came in here this morning, we chased out six or so does, and then Right now, just this afternoon, we're coming in here. We got two does already so far, so, you know, maybe it's the same does from this morning that went down, but we're gonna see. We got, what time is it? We got a couple hours left, so we're gonna sit here, kind of chill out and cool down. And I got a doe and a yearling now down there. So they're not moving fast, so they're not, they haven't seen us or heard us. Wind's going perfect. Nothing is spooked yet. So we're going. We're going good. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I'm so in love with you. You got me down again. It is Sunday morning, our last opportunity for the weekend with Russell. Feeling it? I'm feeling it. Found us a good, a good, a good big size buck today. That's the mission. A what size buck? Good big sized. Big sized? Big sized. And uh, you know, we'll stay warm. It's goal number one. Stay warm. Find a deer. Is it in that order? Priorities. In that order. All skinheads. Oh, that's a wrap. No blood. No blood today. Not this weekend either. Yeah, the rut seems to be tapering off. Haven't seen as many bucks moving around as we used to in the past two weekends. So it was a fun hunt regardless. We were able to get out, do some hiking, check out some stuff. Encountered all kinds of deer, but they're just does. A bunch of does. A bunch of does. So that wraps up pretty much deer hunting for... For the first part of the year. First part of the year. Yep. We'll wait through the whole summer and start all over again. Awesome. We got um, elk draw coming up. Yeah, antelope and elk. Antelope and elk. All right. What are your thoughts on all this hunting, Jacob? Oh, it's awesome. It's awesome. It's just all timing, you know? Mm Mm-hmm. Just all timing. Getting the stars lined up, moon lined up. The first two weeks was just awesome. There's just animals everywhere, big bucks everywhere. 
and uh, all know, of a sudden the switch turns off. Just a matter of one week's time period, and everything is mm -hmm. just down. Yeah, so, yeah. You know, I think when you're at home doing as much homework as possible, doing all your studying, figuring out, you know, when their seasons are at peak peak times, so that's when you gotta be out there yep. for them. Yep. Because if you're not, you're gonna have a really tough time. Absolutely. It's not an impossible task. You just got to do the right kind of work. It's time and effort. Yeah, time and effort. You know, it's that time that on the weekends you got to get a leave of work, go hike in a different area, look in a different spot, you know, try to find as much research as you can. But ultimately all it comes down to is boots on the ground, getting out in the country. You can't just, you know, come out and wing it. Right. Sometimes you get lucky, but if you want to be successful every year, you gotta put that effort in. Right. Any words of wisdom, Russell? God, why do you look so grumpy? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Like, subscribe, leave comments. We love the comments because we can interact with everybody. Stay tuned for more. I think our hunting hunting series is over with, so we're gonna start our back to our off-road and overlanding. So if you guys have any requests, ask Jacob. He'll uh, answer them all. All right, we need food, coffee, and gas.